In this video, I'll be sharing with you how to set up automated digital product delivery in system.io. Let's dive in. Now, the first step in this whole entire process is to head on over to drive.google.com. I'm going to assume you guys have this part all set up, but if you don't, just follow along. Uh, this is where we're going to be storing our digital products. This is where we're going to get our link that we're going to use later on in this video. All you have to do is just click on this new button right here. Click on new folder. And right here, you're going to want to put in your digital product name. So for this example, I'm just going to put in sample product, just like so. I'm going to click on create. And as you can see, there goes the folder. I'm just going to double click on it. And right here, you're going to want to drop in your digital product, whether it's a PDF or a file, you want to make sure you drop it in right here. And as you can see, I just dropped in a PDF file and all you're going to want to do is click on these three dots right here where it says more actions. You're going to want to click on this share. Just come right over here where it says share. Just click on that. And right here, you're going to see that it says restricted right under general access. Just click on that little arrow and you want to click on anyone with the link. All right, cool. So we're going to leave it on this page. What we're going to do is we're going to head on over to system.io. So I'm going to assume you already have your order form and your thank you page all set up. I'm going to share with you how to automate this whole digital product delivery. All right. With automation. So what you're going to want to do is click right here under contacts. You want to click on tags. All right. Once you're here, you want to click on create and for tag name, you want to name it your digital product. So right here, I put sample product. Now I'm going to click on save. The next step you want to do is come right over here where it says automations. You want to click where it says rules. Once you're here, you want to click on this blue button that says create. So right here where it says trigger, you want to click on this plus button. Now you want to click on tag added. Now you want to look for that tag that you created in the previous step. So once you added the tag for your digital product, this is what you want to happen next. You want to click right here on this plus sign under by action. You want to click on that. Now you want to click on send email. This is going to be the email that's going to be sent out right after they make that purchase. And inside of that email is going to be that digital product that you're selling. So we're going to click on this little plus sign right next to email. And right here, you're going to want to add in a subject line. So I have a Google doc right here all set up uh, for an example. So I'm just going to copy that, come back over here to system.io, going to paste that in for preview, download inside, just like so. Now for body, uh, this is what I'm going to put. I'm going to copy that. Come back over here to system.io. Boom. All right. Now we can clean this up. So right here it says, hey. And what you can do is you can use some placeholders. So right here where it says substitute variables, you can click on that arrow. You can click on first name. So pretty much, you know, whoever opts in to buy your digital product, once this email fires off to them, it's going to have their first name inside. So right here it says, thank you so much for purchasing. And it's going to say your digital product name. So right here. You can edit this information. Um, you can literally just pause this video, screenshot this, but it pretty much says, hey, first name, thank you so much for purchasing. And right here is gonna be a digital product. You're all good to go. You can download you know, your digital product here. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me here. Chat soon, and then you can put your name right here on the bottom. So I'm just gonna put Melvin, just like that. So right here, you can just highlight this whole entire thing. Just click right here on this little link button, boom. Now we're gonna head back over here to Google Drive. We're gonna copy this link, come back over here to system.io. We're gonna paste that in. Now we're gonna click on this little uh, check mark to save it. So as you can see, that digital product is right here embedded inside of this email. And now you wanna click right here on the bottom that says save. So right here, you have the tag for your digital product. And right here, you have that email. So this email is gonna fire off right after they make that purchase. So just to, Check out that email once again. Boom, boom, everything looks good. There goes the digital product, all is well. Click on save once again, boom. Now I'm gonna click on save rule, just like so. So as you can see, tag added. This is the tag for the digital product, and this is the email that's gonna be sent out, your digital product inside. So now we're gonna tie this whole thing up, you know, with the funnel that we have. So I'm gonna go right here to funnels. I'm gonna assume you guys have this all set up. So right here on the order form, if you scroll down, you wanna click right here where it says digital product resources. You wanna click right there. Now for resources, you wanna click on this button here. Boom. Now you wanna click on tags, choose a tag. Now you wanna go find that tag for that digital product that you set up that email for. So once you selected the tag for that digital product, you can click right here where it says save. And now everything is saved. So right here, it pretty much says resources, which the customer will have access to after the purchase. 
So right here, I clicked on tags and then you chose the tag for the digital product. So right after they purchase, you know, your digital product, it's gonna automatically tag them. And that's the tag that we set up first for the digital product. And then after that, we set up a rule. So once the tag is added, this email is gonna be sent out. And that pretty much is the name of the game. So that is how you can set up automation inside of system.io for your digital products. Now that pretty much wraps things up for this video. If you found value in this video, consider liking and subscribing and hitting that notification bell. That way you don't miss out on any future videos. And somehow YouTube keeps telling your boy that you should watch this video here. So I'll see you in that video.